just feel like it's not bright enough. Barely. Okay, that is like significantly better. I don't know why it feels so dark in here. Anyways, hey guys. Today, I thought it would be fun to do a little get ready with me. Um, and just like let me vent and stuff. I haven't felt super cute in a while. Um, my boyfriend would get mad at me if I said that. But the truth of it all is I've been so busy and... I work two jobs. I da uh, uh, I teach dance and I also work at a crate place. So I work all the time and I'm just been feeling kind of down about it. And I just want to get all cutie patootie and do something fun. So me and my friend Eva, who I talk about clearly a lot because I've talked about her in not the last video, but the video before that. One of the chat chit chat video it was her suggestion but i'm gonna hang out with her later we're gonna go like thrift and like do stuff whatever before i work my dance teaching job tonight but i wanted to look cute and i think i'm gonna style the top i made in the last video also to start out my routine i'm going to eat my ollie woman's multivitamin there's two of them um anyway we're gonna hang out so I want to look super cutie to lift my spirits. First of all, I don't really know what's happening with my hair. My bangs are getting pretty long and my hair is getting kind of long. But that's okay. I'm going to put these pictures up. I'm kind of debating on letting my hair go out until like here maybe. And then putting like hella layers in it and like sprucing up my bangs. My bangs need sprucing up in general. But I'm kind of going to let my hair just kind of do whatever for now, to be honest. My bangs, however, is a no exception. Like, I have to let that. I have to fix that at some point. But I think that... I kind of think I just want to see what happens. I think this might be the, like, this, either like this or, like, maybe, like, an inch longer. Like, here-ish. Like, two inches longer or something. I don't know. We're just kind of letting it be a little bit just because I work so much anyways that... I feel like I have no time to even go to get my hair done, so I'm just going to ignore it and let it happen. That's my thoughts right now. I'm going to see what other people think about it, but my hair's, my bangs are okay still. They're still like bangy. They're just long bangy, which is fine. We're going to just work with what we work with today. I am going to blow out my hair. My hair's been pretty dry already, but I'm going to attempt to kind of blow it out a little bit so we've got some more textures to it um but yeah that's what i've been kind of up to re recently is just kind of like been working like a ton and i hate it i hate it but it's gonna be a fat check i'm gonna be freaking doing a lot better money wise which is so exciting because i'm a girly who likes to shop i'm a girly who like is convinced that i need certain things to make my life elevated which is annoying of me but i'm just like i really want these pants or stuff like that or like i want to go thrifting so i'm gonna go thrifting today because i have a little bit of money i can spare for a second so i'm gonna go thrifting and just kind of not care about anything because there are certain people and certain things in my life that i don't really want to talk about on the internet because i don't know what if they saw it but i have been really ticked lately and just angry and just kind of not living my best life when it comes to the things that i spend all my day doing and i just want to do something fun something for me and just not be stressed out so that's why i'm like okay i texted eva and i was like girl we gotta hang out let's do it so she's gonna come over later and it's gonna be a good time and we're gonna go drift and stuff before we both have plans later but anyways that's kind of what's happening i'm gonna do my hair real quick I'm gonna have to go clip my nails, actually. BRB, hold on. Anyways, I'm back now. Um, my thumb was starting to peel, so I had to go clip both my thumbs, and they're looking just rough. To be honest, one is still longer than the other, but I don't really know if I care. They just look really bad. I really need to get my nails done, but we're just pretending like it's not happening. Let me do this real quick. It's 
don't think my hair is doing what I want it to do. And I want it to like almost curl, sort of. I don't really know what I want it to do, but we're just going to do whatever that was a little bit more. Um, kind of everywhere. Just holding it there, I think. I don't know if this is going to do anything or not, but it's here like this now, pretty much. Um, anyways, I'm just going to put this to the side now. And we're gonna do my makeup. We're also gonna go like this. Oh, my back is starting to hurt. Oh, okay. I'm back. I'm gonna look at my eyebrows a little bit. Trim them, maybe? Because I feel like they might need it. My eyebrows are pretty crazy, but I really don't want to spend money to go get them waxed. So I'm just gonna pretend like it's not happening. Okay, I think that looks better, but I can't tell. Did it actually do anything? Who knows? Sorry. Anyways, now that I've done that, let's actually start with some makeup stuff. Um, assuming that it's smarter, I'm gonna put on some sunscreen because you always should be putting on sunscreen. Um, I just got this club uh, using the super glue, super goop, right? That's what's called. Super glue glow screen, glow screen. Um, I don't know. I like this one. Uh, the other one I used was, um, the... Skin, skin cuticles, cuticle, yeah, skin cuticles, physical matte UV sun, defense sunscreen. So these are the two that I have. Um, I really like this one. It says absorbs oil, 100% mineral filters, tinted mousse, protect. It's FEF 50. This one's FEF 40. Um, I don't really know. I know this one works really well because one time I wore it all ca through camping and I didn't get sunburn a single time. I don't even think I put sun actual sunscreen on my face a single time. Didn't get sunburn at all. I think I got a little bit tan and like burnt on my arms because that I didn't put this on my arms obviously. But this shit worked. It worked. So got a little bit of that going. Um, I'm going to use my Bare Minerals Bare Pro. I really want to get a liquid foundation but I've been I, I convinced myself that this was like my holy grail and it still is kind of my holy grail but it's more because I was just convinced that like liquid foundations don't work that well on my skin and I still am kind of convinced that but I feel like I should give it another try because um Eva the friend that I'm hanging out with today she had one that I tried that was pretty damn good if you ask me so I kind of want to try a liquid foundation again which I literally have not done in years like I have not done it since like high school or something and I'm pretty damn set on this one because I always have an issue with this being like super flaky and that's like just eyebrow, my huge eyebrow syndrome, whatever. It's fine. Okay, so that like went on so smooth. Like you can't, it looks really weird on camera. I look white and pale, but I promise it's fine. Anyways, I like this one. I have two. I don't know if I've told you guys about this before, but I lost this one and I couldn't find it. I was very upset and then I went and got a new one and this is a different shade kind of awkward but I think this one's actually I'm gonna do a little bit of both because this one I'm pretty sure I I got it in the wind in the summertime so it's a little bit darker because I end up I wear it I was wearing it in the summer I mean in the summer and in the summer I'm just a little bit darker I tan I also just like I don't know I think that's why they're different shades but they also got new packaging and I kind of hate it. I like the old one better, to be honest. 
Okay, we're gonna do a little bit of the Tarte Creases Concealer. I don't, I heard it's bad, but I've never used any other one ever. So if anybody has any suggestions of ones to try, let me know. Oh my God, if this hair, please get out of my face. Okay, let me know, I just, I've never used any other one. So I don't know which ones to try. Um, I'm just using it to like extra coverage on some blemishes, my red spots. Kind of just living my life. I'm gonna go get my beauty blender wet. I'm sorry, I keep walking at the door. Be back. Okay, so I need, I, have, I just kind of like talk and vent and shit, but I am debating on whether I should film a second YouTube video today. And I probably should. Because I haven't been able to post on a Monday in so long. Or like last time I think I did post on a Monday. It was like because I just didn't edit all week. And then I finally got it done. And it was like, oh, I guess it's got in the next uploading day is Monday. So I guess I'm going to post on a Monday. Um, so I feel like maybe I should just film a second video if I can today. And just post, like post both. Like post one of these on Wednesday and the next one on Monday. Because I keep missing them and I was having like okay so i was having a identity crisis crisis oh sorry i keep like shaking the table i was having almost an identity crisis where i i gotta scoop back just a little bit because i so i was like freaking out because i'm a dancer if you didn't know that if you don't know me if you're new to the channel i'm a dancer i want to be a performer a freelance performer a freelance choreographer i want to do all that shit for a living and it's very hard to do and i'm 20 years old and out i only have an associates and that seems to be biting me in the ass just a little bit but i don't feel like it's personally and like also my boyfriend and my mom and everybody that i've talked to about it they don't feel like that's a factor because it's like okay now i'm in the field a little bit sooner than most people are and it's all about just like putting in the work you know, but I'm feeling just a little bit discouraged because everybody that I know in the dance world right now are all, they are all just graduated with BAs in dance. I only have an associates, but I think it's fine. I think it's fine. I don't think it's a big deal, but I don't know. I'm just feeling kind of weird about it. More of my story is, oh, my identity crisis is I was like stressed out because I was like, am I spreading myself too thin between working two jobs? and having a youtube channel and trying to do a podcast with my best friend which if i i would never drop that podcast obviously it's not really going as smooth as i'd like right now because i'm doing five billion things so i need to like figure out how to manage it but i'm still working on getting episodes out for you guys um for those who do watch my youtube channel and listen to the podcast i have two uploads coming i'm going to upload one hopefully on wednesday is my goal but when this comes out, hopefully you guys will get a new one, but it's just so hard to edit. And um, Gigi, my, Virginia, my best friend who does the podcast with me, she had just recently moved. So it's been a little bit tricky. And I have to, technically two to, to edit still. So it's okay because we have some time to like do that, but it's also just tricky because I'm the one who edits and it's kind of just a shit show. I kind of look, no, it looks fine, okay um but anyways long story short is i was like do i quit youtube do i quit youtube because i feel like i'm maybe what if i'm spreading myself too thin and i talked to the boy about it he gave me some good advice just kind of about scheduling and just setting time for each thing and but my second job doesn't schedule me that often so as long as i'm being productive in my mornings i should be able to um do it and well, as long as i'm being pretty productive in my breaks as well i should also be able to do it like like today is one of my days off so i'm gonna film this youtube video and if i should i should film a second youtube video that way i can just edit one tonight and tomorrow and then have another one just like edit throughout the week but i also don't have my degree exactly quite yet i'm doing a class this summer to catch up which is the only last class i need to graduate so it's like kind of just a little bit hectic and that's why videos are a little bit weird. Hi guys, let me just update you guys. I'm using the same blush and the same... I need to stop shaking, sorry. I'm using the same blush and the same... 
highlighter that I always use, and it's always the REM. Um, if Ariana Grande ever wanted to sponsor me, please do, because I use this shit every single day. Every single day. Every once in a while, I'll try to switch it up, but it's so good. It just, it's just so good, and I haven't gotten anything new recently, so. Which is weird, because I have, like, some Fenty stuff, and I used it for not even that long, and then I got new stuff. I've got quite a bit. I got a decent amount. I can't wait to give you guys a house tour and, like, an in-depth house tour. I would love to do a house tour, in decently in-depth house tour. And then I would love to do, like, an in-depth, like, makeup video or, like, where I'm just, like, here's all the makeup I own. Here's all the makeup I own, all the skincare products I own. That would be fun. Just thought. I'm writing that down later. I'm going to put some... Vaseline on my lippies. <laughs> Anyways, back to my identity crisis. So I figured out what I'm gonna do in terms of like making this work because I don't want to give up on my YouTube channel because I love my YouTube channel and I've gotten a lot of new subscribers lately. And it is something that of course I would like to grow and do and become pretty big at. If possible but it's also one of those things where I just really enjoy it it's just something I love to do and I feel like a lot of people I know a lot of my friends also enjoy it like Eva watches my videos all the time like a lot of my friends enjoy it so it's like I should just keep going like I also feel like it's a really good outlet for me like with doing things like this where I'm able to kind of like rant a little bit and just talk and I don't have to like I can just kind of talk and think out my own things and anyway i've come to the realization that i love my youtube channel i'm not getting rid of it i've also come to the realization that i have to remember that i'm only 20 years old and that i've got time to build my brand as a dancer and like because most of the girls that i'm taught like seeing at these auditions are like fresh bas and they um and they are like 22, 23, like I'm not even legal to drink yet. So I have to give myself some grace. And I also have to remember that I've literally been home for a month and a half. I literally have not even been out of school that long. Like, and neither have they. But I just mean like they've been doing shit for four years. And I have only been, I only did college for two. So i'm going to catch up i just have to keep auditioning and keep building and keep practicing and keep um taking classes like i really want to go take classes at dance church i really want to go take more millennium classes and just do stuff and i've been i have been improving a lot um just to kind of keep my body learning new things keep my body doing new things and i think that's gonna help quite a bit that's gonna help quite a bit um i'm gonna be posting a lot of like dance improv stuff on my account so you guys should be checking that out i don't know i'm gonna use this lip gloss my camera my camera turned off but i'm gonna use this lip gloss later i use this is the mm, milani fresh fruit fetish um raspberry peach lip oil it's really nice i like it a lot and then for my lashes, I just used Lash Paradise because it's the Better Than Sex dupe from Walmart. And she works well. I like her a lot. I am going to also probably use my Rare Beauty lipstick at some point too. But these I probably will end up doing off camera to be honest. Because I like to do that like super last. I, mm, I should have put on thought about doing eyeshadow before I did this. Too late now. I guess we're sticking like this. Okay. I'm gonna go and I'm gonna wait another like 30 minutes to like an hour with my hair like this. I'm gonna make maybe like an hour. I'll be back in like an hour and I will finish getting ready with you guys. I'll take out my hair and I'll put my outfit on. For now, I think I'm going to clean up the room and get it ready to film a second video while i'm doing this so i'll see you guys back in like hour hour and a half bye here's the deal i set up you can't hear me or see me but i set up 
my um, situation for my other video. I'm gonna, I filmed a bunch, like two TikToks. I'm excited to film my TikToks. I'm excited to do things. I'm excited, I'm a content creator apparently. But my hair needs to come out because I really wanna film the other one. I want to film both. I want to get going. I feel like I'm running. I can't sit here and wait any longer. But I should probably wait. Like another. Now let's take it out. Let's take them out, shall we? Let's just take them out and see what happens. If it looks like shit, oh well, I guess. I don't know. I'll just cry about it or something. But we'll just take this out and then take this out and. I don't know, I think I really popped off in terms of, okay, don't, we're not gonna, we're not gonna cry yet. Let's give it a second. <laughs> if this doesn't work out, I'll be so upset because I said I was gonna film a different video. Too. Okay, okay. Not great, but not bad. Okay, now I'm just going to flip my hair a bunch of times, okay? Okay, wait, 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 wait. Oh, no. Okay, wait. Okay, wait. It's gonna be fine, guys. It's gonna be just fine. Okay. Is it bad or is it good? I don't know how to do my hair. If anybody likes to teach me, that would be awesome. That would be so superb. It's not horrid. It's not horrid. It's something. Okay, it's not bad. It's fine. I think I think it's fine for now. My bangs are already like kind of long and doing weird things. So we're just gonna pretend like they're not doing weird things. Okay guys, let's put on some lipstick. Oh my outfit. Let's go get my outfit. BRB. Okay, this worked out a lot better than I could. Okay, this is like absolutely everything I ever want in my life. I look hot and slay. I love it. I love it. I love it. So we've just got jeans, my jeans. These jeans, this doesn't matter. This is the part that matters. I made this top in the last um, video. Um, and I'm obsessed with it. So the sleeves are a little scary looking, but don't look closely and then they're fine. Yeah, I made it last time. It's so cute, it's so cute. If I can just like, Lift this up a little bit. Then you can see my tats. But I lift up my arms, but probably won't be lifting arms too much. Anyways, now we can put on lipstick. We'll put on some of the rare beauty. Luckily, what I like about this top is that it's a button up. So I can't really mess up the top. I just have to unbutton it. I take it off. You know? Because I have makeup on. This is the lipstick. So giving i love it okay this one bye guys the fit last fit oh for the thumbnail okay bye guys i'll be guys like that subscribe bye